Who's the better football player, Ronaldo or Messi? Which is the better car, Mercedes or BMW? And what about cloud storage? Is it OneDrive or Google Drive? Some disputes will go on forever, but in this video, we're gonna finally squash the debates between OneDrive and Google Drive and crown the ultimate winner. Google and Microsoft are the two biggest names in the tech space right now. So it's not surprising that users are always comparing their cloud storage services. In this video, we'll compare the features, performance, security, and prices of each cloud service. Who will come out on top in this showdown? There's only one way to find out. Watch this video to the end. But before we get started, I just want to give you a quick disclaimer. The CyberLab team has ranked, rated, and reviewed all the best cloud storage services out there. And right now, we believe pCloud is the best cloud storage service money can buy. Thanks to a slew of awesome features, watertight security, competitive pricing, and user-friendly apps. The good news is, the CyberLab viewers can get a massive 65% discount on pCloud. Click the link in the description box down below to take advantage of this amazing discount. Now, back to the video. Let's start with the features. Now, OneDrive has a lot of amazing features. And the first one I want to talk about is the incredible syncing feature. OneDrive automatically uploads every file on your computer to the cloud. And if you use OneDrive on multiple devices, every change you make on every file will automatically sync across every device. This means you can access your content on all your devices remotely without having them on you, which is pretty cool. Another great feature is OneDrive's Files On Demand feature, which is perfect for anyone who wants to free up some space on their device. With it, you can select which files are online only. These documents can be accessed on OneDrive without having to download them onto your device. The Files On Demand feature is flexible too. If you're working with a folder that's only available online, you can still choose to make its files available on your device. OneDrive also comes with a personal vault feature where you can store your sensitive documents securely. With this feature, you can store your sensitive files, videos, or photos in a secured vault where no one can access them. Of course, the vault is protected by solid security measures, such as two-step identity verification, face ID, fingerprint ID, or PIN. I should mention, though, that if you're subscribed to OneDrive's standalone or free plans, you won't be able to save more than three files in your vault. Only users subscribed to the higher-tiered packages can take full advantage of this feature. Some other nice additions to OneDrive include the ability to play video and audio files from the web and find photos in your cloud storage quickly with the aid of AI-enhanced search that spots objects and landmarks. OneDrive also comes with the popular file versioning feature, which allows you to restore older versions of all your files. Now let's talk about Google Drive. Google Drive certainly stacks up to OneDrive when we look at its features and functionality. One of the great features of Google Drive is the ease with which you can share files between people. You can share folders and files to other collaborators with email invites or regular links. The Team Drive also gives you customized spaces for colleagues to collaborate on different files and folders. It's also worth noting that popular Google products like Docs, Sheets, Slides, and other presentation apps are neatly integrated into this cloud storage service. As such, you can create and access files without any difficulty. They are all refined, slick apps that easily match their rivals. As an alternative, you can also upload files created by Microsoft products and either edit them within Google's applications whilst still retaining the file type, or easily convert them into Google Docs, which definitely comes in handy. Another impressive feature is Google Drive's version history tool. Like OneDrive, this tool allows you to restore or download any older versions of your files if you need to. It's also easy to find your files, no matter how many you have on the drive. There's a search bar located at the top of the interface, allowing you to locate the file you're looking for quickly. You can search by keywords, file type, file name, and words within a file. This includes text in images and PDFs. So what's our verdict here? Well, it's a tough decision. We'll give this round to OneDrive purely for its superior flexibility. But really, there isn't much between either service when it comes to features. Now, let's see how both providers stack up when it comes to security. OneDrive is quite the contender in this area, so let's take a closer look. One of the most reassuring security features on OneDrive is its two-factor authentication. With this feature, nobody can access your account and files without authorization, even if they have your password and username. 
OneDrive also provides you with a personal vault, which adds yet another authentication layer, like a pin or a fingerprint to access. Your data is also protected by military-grade AES-256 bit encryption, which is by far the strongest in the world. However, there is no end-to-end -end encryption, so Microsoft employees can always access your files when necessary. The company promises that this is controlled, but how could the average user be so sure? That said, OneDrive stores your data across multiple servers, which provides further protection against data loss. So overall, we believe OneDrive has a pretty robust security system in place. Now, can Google Drive defeat OneDrive security performance? Well, let's find out. Google Drive offers a lot of great security features, but like OneDrive, there's no end-to-end -end encryption. This means Google engineers can access your files if they suddenly decided they wanted to. You wouldn't even know about it. It also doesn't help that Google was involved in the recent PRISM scandal. While this does not mean Google shares your data at all, we're just saying nobody would know if they did since they have a back door into your account. Aside from that, Google generally has great measures in place for security. It offers different grades of two-factor authentication with many checks to block unauthorized access. It also protects your data using AES 256-bit encryption, which is more or less unbreachable. So, who wins this round? Again, we're going to give it to OneDrive. While both companies have very similar security measures, Google's involvement in the PRISM scandal is just a big turnoff for us. Now, let's see how OneDrive and Google Drive compare in terms of pricing. But first, I want to thank Hornet Security for sponsoring this video. Hornet Security offers 365 total protection, which seamlessly integrates with Microsoft Cloud services, especially Microsoft 365, to provide comprehensive protection for Microsoft Cloud services. It's easy to set up and use, and you can even take the product for a spin free of charge without any obligations. So check out hornetsecurity.com for all your Microsoft Microsoft 365 security requirements. Now, back to the video. We'll look at OneDrive's pricing first. OneDrive offers a range of packages for home users. To start, there is the free storage only 5 gigabyte plan. There are no fancy features with this plan and it's pretty basic. As an alternative, you can choose one of the multiple paid plans like OneDrive standalone 100 gigabytes, costing just $1.99 per month. Standalone 100 gigabyte plan is also a storage only plan, so you won't get any access to any extra Microsoft products. To enjoy more from Microsoft's endless range of products, you'll need to choose a higher tiered plan, like the Microsoft 365 Personal. It costs $59.99 per year and comes with one terabyte of cloud space. In addition to the cloud storage service, it also gives you full access to Skype and some Office apps like Outlook, Excel, Word, and PowerPoint. For family purposes, you can choose Microsoft 365 Family, which costs just $79.99 per year. It features everything on the Microsoft 365 personal plan, but also grants you up to six licenses. Each user gets one terabyte of storage, so we think it does provide real value for money. Now, how does Google Drive compare? Well, like OneDrive, Google Drive also offers a free plan, albeit with a larger cloud space of 15 gigabytes, which is pretty generous. The paid plans start at 100 gigabytes, which costs $1.99 per month or $19.99 per year. It's Google's best value plan, and most everyday users won't need any more storage than this. However, the standard 200 gigabyte plan is another decent option if you need a little more cloud space. It costs $2.99 per month, or $29.99 per year, while giving you a host of extra benefits. While the first two plans will likely solve your basic needs, if you need even more cloud space, there is also the premium 2 terabyte plan, costing $9.99 per month, or $99 a year. Finally, some reprieve for Google Drive, as it edges OneDrive to take the win for this round. While both companies' plans are similarly priced, Google Drive's flexibility makes it our choice. Finally, let's look at the interface of each cloud storage provider. How does OneDrive fare? Unsurprisingly, OneDrive works best with Windows, where it's fully integrated into the system. On Windows, OneDrive appears in the navigation panel along with desktop, documents, and everything else. That way, you can easily right-click on your folders and files and move them to OneDrive or to ensure you have copies. Alternatively, you can use the web interface, but we must warn you that it's not really there in terms of aesthetics. It's a mixed bag for other platforms. Mac OS's client doesn't offer any sophistication, but it helps you do everything that you want easily, which counts for something. 
There is also an option to launch OneDrive with your computer, which a lot of users will appreciate. However, if we're being honest, OneDrive gets in the way of Apple's own cloud storage service, iCloud. The mobile client is where OneDrive delivers its best performance. The applications for iOS and Android are very elegant and intuitive. Users can jump around files and folders with a couple of taps and swipes. The clients are especially good at syncing videos and photos that you've taken on your phone. Now let's move on to Google Drive's interface. You can access Google Drive in three different ways, through the web interface, a mobile application, or backup and sync, a tool that lets you integrate your Google Drive folder into Finder or Windows File Explorer. The web interface has a decent and simple design, but nothing fancy. A distinctive folder structure and icons allow you to locate every tool you require without any difficulty. To add files, you can just drag and drop them, which makes things super easy. Alternatively, you can go through the menu options if you prefer. Generally, copying, organizing, and creating folders and files is very easy. The mobile application offers a similar but downgraded design, which allows you to easily switch between your devices without losing track of your files. After a short setup process, the cloud service automatically syncs between your devices. This means if you save a document into a Google Drive folder on your mobile device, you can instantly access it on your desktop. Not only that, but you can also grant other people remote access to any document. To be honest, it's virtually impossible to separate the cloud services in this category, as both offer very similar performances in terms of the interface. To sum it all up, we're crowning OneDrive as the winner in this particular showdown, mainly because it's slightly better features and tighter security. While Google Drive is not far behind at all, we believe that the developers need to put in a little more work if they want to catch up to OneDrive. We also can't get over the fact that Google Drive was recently involved in a privacy scandal. That alone lost them some serious points. And now it's over to you. Do you prefer OneDrive or Google Drive? Let us know in the comments below. We reply to everyone. The next video is a must watch. It's our rundown of the best cloud storage services out there. So don't miss it.